Hello and welcome to my Valheim series, the series where I am playing through Valheim and learning to play the game just by playing the game and comments from you guys. So we just docked, we've got our iron, well we've got some of our iron, I want to throw some things away, hold on. Well actually no, there isn't anything I want to throw away, let's just swap some things around in the boat. There we go, that'll do us for now. So I want to go and smelt all this up and uh, see what we can make, so we're just going to run across here, so I will see you in a sec. Okay, so I've chucked in as much iron and coal in as I can, so while that's smelting, I'm going to go over to the trader because you guys have told me that I need Izmir flesh to make the cool thing out of the elite Draga trophy. So do I have anything to sell? If not, I'm going to have to dip into my cold, into my coin reserve. So I've got 66 coins, I've got an amber... I've got that, and I've got eight amp pills. So that should be enough to buy me a couple of things of Yzma flesh. I can't remember how many I needed. I'm going to double check, and then we will go over and see. So I just checked comments, and I need four Yzma flesh. So I'm hoping that what I've got will... Uh, actually, I should just go through my portal. That what I've got will be enough to buy four of those. Now, I think I need 30 iron as well. And it makes some sort of, like, slide charm. It's kind of like... An upgrade to the star breaker, I know. Um, but I think I'm going to use my iron because we, we've got loads more iron left to uh, use to get some stuff from uh, from that crypt that we had. So uh, we're gonna we're gonna see what this this sledgehammer thing is. I want to. I'm, I'm excited. I've just gone all the way around. What an idiot! On second thought, I could have just run from my base. Like the distance between is. I'm probably faster going from my base. I don't know. I mean, is it... Well, I kind of guess there is still a point to keep that portal there, just in case he's, you know... I'm gonna press R so I can run faster, because you guys always say, you forget to put the R, press R, and I do forget to press R all the time. Wow, but what I need to do is I need to put these in my hotbar then, don't I? That, that would make more sense. I didn't want to press that, though. Well, we didn't, know. Ready, watch. Ready, ready, ready. Ah. Oh, don't come out now. I'm trying to show off my skills. Oh, troll. Everyone's coming. Right, I'm just running. I'm just going to... Look. I'm just going to, to Haldor. He'll, he'll sort me out. He'll help. Go away, everyone. Don't like you. I'm fed up of fighting you guys. Hello. I'm here. I have arrived. Hi. I would like some flesh. I don't even know what... Izmir flesh is of the giant Emir. Oh dear. Doesn't sound very good. Okay, so I need four of those. I've only got enough for one. Okay, so there's the iron sledge I can make. So I need to go back and get my gold for my gold pile. Um, I don't think I want it. I can buy a Yule hat. No, I don't want another Yule hat. We've got enough Yule hats. Okay. I will see you in a sec. We'll go and get some more gold and uh, buy some more Izmir flesh. So I'm guessing I'm gonna have to just break these, these, these coins. But I kind of don't want to break. I'm, I'm gonna break my coin pile. I think. Otherwise, I'll end up breaking the table as well. Wait, I can just use my hammer, can't I? Oh. I'd rather get rid of the coin piles than my big, my nice big uh, pile of gold. There we go. That should be enough, I think, for another... I got 408. I think they were like 120 each, weren't they? Now you need four. Okay, let's go see. What I want to know is, why does a Haldor sell flesh of a giant? Like, did he kill the giant? Is that why Haldor's so short? Like, the giant, like, squashed him? Like, well, what happened? What's the, what's the story behind this? Hi. I will check this stuff out. I want... Yeah, it is It is a fantastic choice, I know. Oh, what happened to your bonfire? Oh, wait. It's okay. I, I'm on fire too, but I, I deserve her after breaking your fire, so. You are short for a dwarf, I know. You keep you keep reminding me. I like these birch trees in, in here. They, they look kind of pretty. So, I have my flesh. I needed ancient bark and also some iron. Okay, let's see what this uh, iron sledge is like. A mighty hammer worthy of a champion. 
How does it compare to my, uh, to my stag breaker? It's pretty cool. The only thing that's, that the stag breaker is better at is it has a better block force. The block force of the stag breaker is 70, but the block force for the iron sledge is 50. But I'm still going to build it because it's better on every other level. So let's have a look. Let's see how it looks. Wow. Oh, it's pretty. I don't understand why you need a Draugr Elite trophy for that, though, but... I guess you've got to, like, show your prowess before they allow you to build her, I guess. Okay, so... I think the next thing we need to do is I need to go and make some more food, because I am outers. And then we'll go back on the boat to get some more scrap iron so we can upgrade our stuff. So, I will see you in a sec. Okay, so I want to make some more um, poison resistance potions, because I haven't got any. But I haven't got any necktails. So I'm going out to find some necks, and uh, I'm going to try and use this. I want to see what happens. <gasps> well, that's a lot of fun, isn't it? Bit overkill. It didn't even give me a tail! Oh, Maybe I squashed him and just pounded him to a pulp. There was no tail to get. It doesn't seem so many necks around as usual. Do they, like, hide when it's raining? Got all these birds to shoot. This is fun. Okay, the rain is cleared up now, so maybe we'll have more luck with some necks now. Yeah, there, there's one. Maybe they do hide when it's raining. Although this one wants to swim away. Where are you going? I want to kill you. Thank you. Yeah, they're all out now. They must, they must hide when it's raining. Oh, that's kind of cute though. No, I really don't want to kill them. Yeah, double kill. Well, almost. Okay, so I've got a poison resistance brewing in there. I've made myself some more food. Um, so I think what we'll do now is we'll go over on the boat and get some more stuff out of that crypt. I doubt I'll need a poison resistance for the crypt. So I'm going to leave it for now. I think we'll, we'll just need that for when we're actually exploring the swamp. Because I feel like I can get to the swamp. Oh, no, that's probably not the best idea. We'll wait. We'll wait. What else do I need to do? I know what I need to do. I need to dig a trench around my base, don't I? So let's do that while we're waiting for the mead, the potion, the poison potion thingamadoodle is brewing. And then we'll take it with us. Alright, so I've started digging a moat, but I've had to stop because my pickaxe is broken. Um, obviously, I've had to leave a little bit of a gap over here so I can still get in and out this way. Because my side entrance, I use the side entrance a lot coming back from berry runs and from all that stuff. So we've got a, a, little, a little gap here, which should be fine. Um, and I just started doing it around here. I did go a little bit too close here. I forgot that, you know, my building was going to be floaty. So, uh, I'm going to have to fix that. But, um, I've got quite a lot of stone now. Well, I got 44 stone, which isn't actually that much. I thought there was more than that. I was going to say we'll build some more stone onto here. But i got to be honest, I don't know how much stone I've got left to put on there, to be honest. I think, I think most of it now is just wood. Because... I want a roof, obviously, up here. I want to cover this little bit over. I'm still unsure what I'm going to be doing with this central bit. I might leave it as it is and just have, like, a central courtyard. That might be pretty cool. I might build the walls up another another one height just to just to make it look a bit nicer. I don't know, but we'll, we'll, we'll get there. So um, I'm going to go and see if my... Poison resistance mead is uh, is done. Let's go and fix this uh, pickaxe first. And uh, and then we'll go on the boat. Okay, so still fermenting. I'm going to see if I can sleep just to speed up the process a little. Okay, I can't sleep at this time. So I need to find something else to do. Is my crops grown yet? No, they have not grown yet. I've taken all the honey out of the hives. Hmm, I'm trying to think, is there anything I need to do desperately? Yes, I need to get more wood. Let's chop some more wood while I'm waiting for that to ferment. So, has this fermented yet? Nope. Can I go to sleep? Yes, I can. Okay, let's see if it's ready. Yay! Huzzah! Okay, I'll put three in the box and we'll take three with us. Um, So, I've got my hoe as well so that we can hold the ground down to round the certain no i think we need to pickaxe it don't we i'm very concerned about going to see that certain i gotta be honest okay so i guess we're heading over to the boat then 
Okay, before we head on out then, let's remove that from the map. We still got a few things in storage, but they can stay there for now. We're not taking them back right now. And we want to go over here. So, if anything exciting happens, like serpents and stuff, I'll let you know. But otherwise, I'm just going to sail. See you in a sec. Are we going to have an awesome landing? Is it is it going to be good? Oh, oh. Four out of ten. I'm making sure to repair my boat this time. All right, so let's go back to this crypt then. Did I even mark it on the map? I don't think I did. I kind of know where it is though. Before I do that, I need to take one of those. Let's get rid of this spawner. There we go. That won't be a problem for us anymore. <gasps> There's a chest there. <gasps> oh, a chain. And some gold. Nice. So is this the crypt that we went in or is this a different crypt? Because I haven't actually got the crypt key. No, this is... Oh, no, this is the one. This is the one. There's another one over there. So we've got... There's another one just there. So we got a good lot of stuff. All right, let's mark this on the map. I think there might be one over there, too. Or is that a cave? No, I think that's, that is a... That is one as well. Okay, we, we're doing good so far. All right, I'm just going to go in and clear this out and uh, see you in a sec, guys. All right, so there's less left to clear than I originally thought. I only got eight scrap iron, but, you know, it's better than nothing. So I'm going to go and have a look at this circling thing, which I'm a bit nervous about. We're going to see what it's all about. Oh, there's another spawner there. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna to hit it from here. I think that might be a better idea. Nice. So now we've only got the skeleton spawner here to get, which I'm hoping I can hit here too. Nice. Okay, that is much better strategy. I will do... Oh! Well, at least we know that's there now. Alright, I'll just come around this way then and, and get it from here, if I can reach. Uh, oh god. There's one of those circling guys. I didn't know they moved, I thought they were just a thing in the floor. Oh, heck. Oh, 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 those things are coming for me now. Oh, right, hang on. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute, let me, let me, let me... Oh. Right, let me hide. Let me get this one dragger first. Okay. Let me just run over here a sec. So I can assess. I do not have any health potions on me. I should have made more. Right, so these certain dudes, they run fast. Oh my god. So... How did you guys said to, like, put the land around them? Because they seem to not go on land. Oh, there's another drog coming. Let me just go in here a minute. Just so I can <laughs> sort myself out. So I think if I... If I hoe the land, will that, like... I don't know. Or if I gotta like, no, I don't want to raise the land. No, I don't want to pickaxe the land. But like, do it around them? How do you guys do that? Okay, I need to go and sort that Draugr spawner first, because that one's that's gonna be an issue for me. At least, at least they can't cross the water to me. But there are three of them all grouped together now, which isn't the greatest. Let's have some more food. Okay, I can hit it from here. No. Oh, God. Okay, we're just gonna have a quick dip in here. Excuse me. 
He pushed me back in! Where did that drogo elite go? Oh, there he is. Get owned, son. Okay, I need to take that spawner out. Because it's just gonna be an issue for me if I don't. Alright, sweet. It's done. What's in the chest? Precious, precious items. <sighs> okay. I think we might have to throw these. So let's do that now. What else do I really, really need? I guess the oohs. I got lots of oohs. Let's put that in for now. Okay, so these certlins. How do you cope with these? Oh, oh, he's coming. Oh, they're not too hard to sort. And they give you certain cores. So I'm guessing it's this thing. Oh, so there is a thing in the floor. And I've got to just, I guess, hit around this to, like, make sure that they, when they spawn, that they're just in the water. I'm assuming this is where they come out of. Is that, is that correct? Is that, is that the way I should do it? So that they kind of... When they spawn, they just die. They don't seem to be spawning now. I don't know. I want to go back home on my boat because I'm. I I need to relax. I'll get that sailing call though. Ooh, and call. I no, they're not as scary as I thought they were going to be, which is good. What the hell was that? I don't know. I'm seeing things now. So that's one good thing. But yeah, let me know if that's the correct way and if that is the thing that spawns them. I'm hearing noises now that I don't know what they are. Okay, back home on the boat. Are we gonna land here, okay? Is it is it gonna is it gonna is it gonna stop? Perfect. Okay, so now we are back on dry land. That is where we're gonna end the video for today, guys. So thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, remember to give this video a thumbs up as it helps the channel immensely. And if you wanna watch more content like this, please remember to subscribe. If you wanna go and watch some more of my Valheim videos, I have a playlist right here. Have a wonderful rest of your day, wherever you get up to, and I will see you all next time. Bye.